now we are going to discuss typical channel of distribution. So first of all we need to understand what the distribution channel is. Actually distribution channel is a connect, is a link between the two things, between the production as well as between the consumption. So between the producer and the consumer. So everything in between, every bridge, every connect, every link in between is considered as distribution channel. So distribution channel normally can be a single layer, a single layered channel, a single level channel, which is very simple, very easy, not very complicated, directly producer is approaching to the consumer. So this is very simple, very easy thing. Next part, next simple thing, if I can say it can be multi-layered also. Jaha par, there can be different intermediaries jo ki involve ho jenge ho sare process ke andar. For example, in this case, the product will not be going directly from producer to consumer. In this case, product will be going from producer to the distributor or to the wholesaler and from these wholesaler to the retailer and then from retailer to the consumer. So that means different levels, different layers will be added into this distribution channel. So if I can take you to one comprehensive example. So actually a distribution channel is a chain of businesses or a chain of intermediaries which are involved in the process from producer of giving selling the products to from producer taking the products from producer to the end consumer which means everything and anything which is taking the products which is along has helping you in taking the products from the manufacturer or producer or importer to the end consumer let me give you good example of it for example here you will see the internet part also that even internet has been considered also one of the distribution channel that because it is helping the product it is helping the manufacturer the producer to get the product from to, to the customer to take the product to the end customer now we have this graph which will help you this figure will really help you in understanding the whole concept of this typical channel of distribution आपको ये बात समझ आ गई है कि डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन चैनल क्या था एक लिंक था एक कनेक्ट है जो कि हेल्प कर रहा है फ्रॉम प्रोड्यूसर टू दी कंज्यूमर तमाम चीजों को टिपिकल चैनल ऑफ डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन आपके सामने इमेज के तौर पे जो नजर आ रहा है दैट इज वेरी क्लियर पिक्चर हमारे पास देर इज अ मैन्युफैक्चर नॉर्मली मैन्युफैक्चर सेल इट्स प्रोडक्ट्स टू दी होलसेलर और टू दी होलसेलर्स नंबर ऑफ होलसेलर्स दीज नंबर ऑफ होलसेलर्स विल सेल दीज प्रोडक्ट्स टू द रिटेलर्स and these retailers normally will sell this product to the final consumer so this is typical channel of distribution normally if if we say that what are the benefits associated to this typical channel of distribution so you can really see that for example manufacturer a or manufacturer b or manufacturer c is selling his product to the wholesaler and this wholesaler is selling its product to the multiple retailers multiple retailers and then these multiple retailers is selling these products to the end consumer which is the original objective and if you see the whole benefit in the whole process is the efficiency because it is not possible for all manufacturers ke wo products ko directly consumer tak pahuncha sake directly because then it is not cost efficient then it is not resource efficient then it is not energy efficient it is not efficient in respect of anything so best part best possibility kya hamare paas ke different manufacturers hain wo different wholesalers ko sell kar rahe hain apne products ko aur wo different wholesalers approach kar rahe hain different retailers ko aur wo different retailers jo hain unke paas tamam tarah ke customers ki assortment maujood hai aur wo un products ko sell kar rahe hain to the end consumer good example hamare paas वन पाकिस्तान के रेफरेंस से एंड वन एग्जांपल इज रिलेटेड टू फॉर एग्जांपल मैंने यहाँ पे यूके के एग्जांपल मेंशन किया है अगर हम बात करते हैं पाकिस्तान के एग्जांपल में तो नॉर्मली इस टिपिकल चैनल ऑफ डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन को तकरीबन तमाम एफएमसीजी कंपनीज जो हैं वो फॉलो करी हैं बेशक वो एग्जाम्पल हो यूनिवर के हवाले से बेशक वो एग्जाम्पल हो नेस्ले के हवाले से अगेन द प्रोसेस द चैनल ऑफ डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन इज द सेम दे आर द मैनुफैक्चर इन दिस केस or the producer in this case and they are selling to the wholesalers wholesaler is selling these products to the retailer and retailer is selling this product to end consumer isi tarike se yahi typical channel of distribution uk mein normally drug companies which is the pharmaceutical companies jo hain wo follow kar rahi hoti hain medicine companies jo hain wo follow kar rahi hoti hain because in this case what they do they sell these product to the end consumer bahut simple tarike se they sell these products 
through the retailers. Retailer buy this product from the wholesaler and these pharmaceutical are the manufacturer. So, the complete role, if I also study this vice versa, then the complete role will help you to understand the typical of channel of distribution. So, whenever you have to understand this concept, it is very easy to understand. First of all, distribution channel is necessary to understand. What was it that we had? जो कि ये था कि वो एक लिंक है बिटवीन प्रोड्यूसर एंड कंज्यूमर और दूसरी बात हमने कही कि इम्पॉर्टेंट बात कि उस टिपिकल चैनल के अंदर तमाम इंटरमीडियरीज शामिल हैं प्रोड्यूसर से होलसेलर होलसेलर से रिटेलर और रिटेलर से कंज्यूमर